will break. What the fuck am I going to do? You know that my fastball moves like crazy out there. Alright. See what we want to work on. We got... Definitely want to up the velocity on that. I definitely want to up my control on that at some point. The brake could be getting up. Field practice. Uh, don't care. Durability. The HR. Durability cap. Pitching clutch. Could help. Um, let's do this one. I'll do this one. Upper velocity a little bit, so our knuckler's a little bit harder. But, but and our K9 goes up as well. Another DH, good. I don't have to worry about hitting. You know, I didn't do too bad at double A, but for and triple A, it's definitely not easy for me to hit. I just like that I had seven saves in double A because they decided, hey, you should be a closer. The same shit that happened last year. I don't know why they want me to. to I don't think I've ever had it happen again after. Stepping in, Luis Lopez. As we run you the numbers to see the splits between July and August. There's a knuckle ball that so that slight little bit probably won't make a huge difference on my speed, but it'll work. Visiting club as they enter play here this evening. They come in in the midst of a stretch where they've dropped six of their last nine. I like how I even really looked at. Not looking if we're winning or losing too much. I'm more focused on just when am I gonna pitch. I should look and see like how terrible we are. I know we're not doing that great. You start looking forward towards the end of the season. Yeah, but you got to find a way, Dan. You know as well as I do. You got to look in the mirror. You're playing for way Damn. more. Damn. Hoping to get him to chase. This team is underachieved. You got to keep grinding. You got to find a way to put your foot on the gas and show up to the yard every day ready to go. Yeah, you got to. No matter how much we suck. Yeah, I'm still out here pitching no matter how inconsistent I get. <laughs> Strike. Oh, away. Here now the 2-2. Two -two. On the ground to third. Ooh, good. Now don't throw him off the bag. Thank you. I don't even trust it when it goes to that third baseman. He's proved to be kind of nerve-wracking. Look at that. Someone who's actually decent against righties. Oh, well, all right. Am I not wearing my glasses? I thought I have it where I wear regular glasses the entire time, and they just take them off. Always happens. I just ran at it just to be safe. Right, good. I didn't fuck it up right in the first inning. Charlie Tilson now comes forward. He enters play hitting down in the 240s for the year. And he gets ahead 0 and 1. The wind up and the 0 1. Wow. He's going to take that. I'll, I'll accept this. Sometimes you just can't overthink it. If a guy can't hit a certain pitch in a certain quadrant, why would you. Right, recover and get that or just run away from the ball. I was and throw it to second. Good, good. No, it works. I got the strikeout anyway. <laughs> he got terrified of the ball and decided to run. I knew that was going to happen eventually every time I threw it in the dirt. He fucking, like, got terrified. Oh, I couldn't get the inside. I don't know why I would throw it inside. There's a hole on the, that side, so he can get right past the first baseman. Taking strike one. I don't want to throw it inside. On at first, nobody out. Hey, here we go, big guy. Waiting for yours. Stop calling me big guy. Right, just because my dude's fat doesn't mean you got to point it out, all right? Don't shame me. The one, two. Is a fastball down below the knee. Right. He didn't want to chase. Working for the punch out and the offering. Oh, there we go. I'm always nervous throwing that low because I'll throw it in the dirt and with the runner on. Always 
comes like shit fast. The numbers on this team, the one Ooh. thing that jumps off the page. Not doing so great. These guys can flat play D. The highest oh, yeah. percentage in the league. Something to Apparently we're really good at playing D. Strike one to start the Then I see us make errors. Here's the O one. Breaking ball in for a strike. No ball, two strikes. Ready with the O two. And Not where I wanted that at all. Damn it. Here he comes on a ball and two strikes. And he lays off <laughs> Thought that it would be tempting. Wasn't that tempting. Tapper up the line. That winds up foul. Good catch. A grab. One more time. Open the dirt. The dirt here. Looks like it just goes through his crotch. Forget about the double play now as he'll move up to second here on the wild pitch. And that's oh, well, it sets up the double play, I guess. I don't know how fast that dude is, though. Adam Engel, and he's a guy looking to break out in a big way. Okay, he's really fast, so double play is probably out of the question with him. And a strike called at the knees, nothing in one. Hey, that's a huge pitch right there. You've got to get ahead. You see traffic on the base pass your defense All right, that works tighten up a little bit the best little blooper for it out and get ahead all one little pop up i guess i don't i don't even know what that would be Stepping considered into the box adrian delgadio who's all over delgadio two on two out and of course here in inning number two bottom of the second here with no score and a chance to get to what an arm Run comes across to score, and they jump ahead one nothing. My pitching clutch. I do need to improve that. After that pop up, it looked like the inning was potentially over. Big two out base hit to drive in a run. Yeah, you watch your teammate in front of you miss his pitch. He got a nice pitch to hit right there and pops it up. You could tell he was dejected as he went back to the dugout. All you're trying to do is be a great teammate. Sean Casey. So all you're doing is be a great teammate. Oh my god. I didn't think he got him out. I was like, son of a bitch. Right. Well, we only gave up one out of that mess, so it's okay. Not getting any favorable calls, so, you know, understandable. That one's way inside. Jesus. That's a good approach when you're facing a young arm you might not be too familiar with. Take a look at a few and see what he's got. Now he's got himself ahead in the count. Ooh. That fooled him. Here now the 2 2. God, that was hanging. And he missed it. He tried. He tried to reach over the shoulder to grab that. Didn't work. That one hung, though. No. Really never had a chance at that one at all. It was over his head before he knew it. Bouncing off the base of the wall for an easy double. Those are the kind of shots anyone... Man, oh man, we just don't have our control at all. Excuse me, umpire. Apparently I'm just going to walk right in his face. As also on the play, a run comes across to score. Well, the beat goes on with this guy, runner in scoring position. No doubt when he comes up, he's thinking RBI. Way too early. Double the drive in another run. This guy is a money, money run producer. Oh, couldn't catch the bottom. Too low, apparently. Wow. Why did he swing at that one? Wow, not sure what you're looking for right there, but... That one was pretty much middle, middle, center cut. Tough pitch to take. The count now at two and two. To short. To his right. Well, that'll get the guy to not move. So that works. I'll take it. Stepping into the box, Charlie Tilson. He looked to bounce back after striking out his last time up. No balls and a strike to count. Maldonado, the runner at second with one away. Jesus. I love throwing it down and I just fuck up and it's like all the way up here. Got it. Here's the oh, and two. oh my god. That was an awfully close pitch right there. I know if I'm on the mound, I want that pitch called to strike. That's one of those that could go either way. I mean, that was more on the zone, damn it. 
breaking ball that's holy shit this umpire hates me wow that was a close pitch on one and two the count's now at two and two but boy that one very easily could have been called strike three really close pitch high in the air not much else i was just like fuck it throw it down the middle crush it or nothing because i've gotten some real shit calls on that at bat Stepping up now, Dean DeBro, runner in scoring position with two counts. I was gonna say if he calls that a strike, I'm gonna throw up. Runner in scoring position at second with two down. Takes a look down at the knees for a strike. You know, I think this is a big situation in this game. They've got to lead by a couple of runs, but they Man, our offense is dead. when this one's over and think that they left some runs out there on the base path. Well, he wanted to. He was thinking about it. Even count, two balls and two strikes. And we just don't have our control. Three and two. For the guy in the mound, this is one of those innings where nothing comes easy. He's thrown a bunch of pitches, and this AB hasn't been any different. Definitely laboring at the moment. Got him. Hey, but like I said, I don't mind that we're having some struggles. Double A is a lot easier, and then to come up and keep duplicating that was not something I wanted to keep doing. I don't mind having a little bit of a fuck up and a little bit of a, a like a like a cold spell for a bit here. Oh, sorry, just some teams in baseball that you're just not good against. Granted, I always forget who the fuck's who in the minor league. In the majors, I'd be more, you know, I'd notice which teams I suck against. Standing in, Adam Engel. He's 0 for 1 thus far. A frustrated swing and miss at a knuckleball. I don't know what that was. There's a fastball pretty close that time, but ruled a ball 1 and 1. So 1 1. Back to back fastball. Still couldn't get him to call it. Damn it. Sometimes it can be difficult for a pitcher. You're facing a guy that's not known to be a big stick in the lineup. Sometimes the toughest thing is to be aggressive and throw strikes. Three and one to We're usually pretty good on strikes, but lately this one, our control's been all over the place, and we're not getting a lot of favorable calls. So we're kind of forced to work around a lot worse than we usually do. And we don't have overpowering stuff, so I can't be challenging people. I gotta stick low and on the corners, and I got a favorable call. I get angry with him. Now you know my feelings. My character should be like fucking livid <clears throat> out here. I didn't think I had it. The way this umpire's been calling, I don't got jack shit. Unless it's like. Heavily over the plate. Below the zone. Two out, nobody on. Ooh, somehow I didn't get that one. There it is. Didn't show the curve that entire at bat. Now you recover for this last inning. A five nothing finish tonight. The Knights took the lead in the second inning and rode that until the very end. Ronaldo Lopez wins his third of the season. No, I get it. I get the loss after one earned run, but shit, you would think the other guy'd get a loss when we started to lose five to nothing. But you know, me giving up the run, we can never recover. It's like son of a bitch. Uh, let's see. Get our fastball control up. Fastball break. Upper power. Ah, yes, some training. We're almost at the end. Not great, not terrible.
We had a much more successful double-A career, but of course, that's how it always is. I think that was the same like thing with last year. We destroyed double-A, and then triple-A was a little rocky, but still good. And then majors, we were like back and forth. We sucked, we did good, we sucked, we did good. It was just kind of a jump around. It just depends. Big dog Tony is on the mound for game two. What's your take on him, Dan? This guy has three pitches that he brings into his mix. I think we lost because I didn't have my glasses. <laughs> he has a chance to be the really same fucking solid. team again. Pitcher, but he needs command of all three of his pitches. And a cold yeah, if I ha lose command of him, I'm I'm screwed. Fellas are home nine as they begin play here this evening. They come in on the heels of a victory last time out, but they've been in a bad stretch recently, losing five of their last eight ball games. Yeah, Matty B, we're looking at a team. I love watching how tired I get and how less and less that movement on that curveball gets. And I think they expect a little bit more. Just the break dies on that. In front of your home fans. They need to find a way to win this game and, and, and try and take three out of the first five of this home game. We're going to have the same fucking umpire again, aren't we? misses the inside corner. Hit to short. Iguchi loves it. And there's one gone to begin the evening. So coming to the plate, Leo... That's got nothing. To take his first cuts here. Is his first that bad ever, or is he just that terrible? That's <laughs> what Clint looked like. He's like, who is this guy? Behind 0-2 now. Bases are empty, one man out. Oh, man. One and two. I had to get him with he's that. If he doesn't go right back to that same pitch. You could tell he jelly-legged him at the plate a little bit. Frozen. Yeah, his legs became jelly out there. You saw it. Three called, as he couldn't It'd be funny if he didn't see his legs like, shake. Like, what the fuck? Coming to the plate now, Joaquin Maldonado. And as you take a look I don't even know what that pitch was. It looked like a massive curve. The wind-up and the 0-1. Swing and a little blooper to center. Griffin moving in. Hey, no, that's what they say. A bloop and a blast get you going. So. Hey, there's a nice knock by the three-hole hitter. I know there's two outs, but they always say with your man coming up, the number four-hole monster, as soon as he steps in the batter's box. Not your man. <laughs> I like how he says when you're man. the count. He takes his first cuts in this one with a man at first and two away. And I don't really want to be thrown out there because he's going to hit it into the hole, and I don't want that. different philosophies on it. So, Dan, what was your approach at 0 counts? My philosophy is this. I think the last thing you want to do is throw non-competitive pitches, Matt. Throw something down. Oh, and he couldn't get it. Good dive, though. Getting dirty to try. Doesn't serve any purpose. Wow, looked like an easy beginning of this inning. Gets the first two guys out. Then the three and four hitters all of a sudden start locking in on him. And now he's... Uh, Got to get through this fifth hole hitter to get out of this inning unscathed. Yeah, he's definitely put his feet to the fire right here. This number five guy, he's known. He sits in that well, this team kind of fucked me up last time, so I'm not surprised if they're got a lock on me. And another foul ball. Ooh, thank God he got it. I thought it was going to go under his glove. I like it's going to go under his glove and I'm Willie fucked. Bryant, he was headless in the shutout last night. Hey, we're still in the early stages of this one. They're only down by a couple of runs, but it's really key for this leadoff guy to try to get on and get yeah, If this is my start. last game, I think from what I saw in the calendar, then I'll be glad to end it on a if not a win, a quality start if I could. All right, thanks guy out there yelling boo. Now the 2-1 even the home crowd doesn't really care much for Tony Clit. Foul ball, strike two. The two-two. Swung on and missed, strike three. That or they hate this fucking umpire. And Charlie Tilson now comes forward. Batting seven. Center fielder. Charlie I wonder if there's going to be training over the offseason. Certain, like, training bullpen and all that, or if they're just going to be like, nah. Oh, I couldn't catch the corner. All I wanted was that corner. We'll go back to it and nearly fucking take out his legs. You know, we'll see him work both sides of the plate with his curveball. 
There's also a train going by. I would have loved to run over to help, but my guy just stops if it's not needed. Now at the plate, Adrian Delgadio, as he'll get his first opportunity in this one. And that misses for ball one. Son of a bitch. Yeah, that's that's not where I wanted that at all. Neither was that. Pretty good pitch to hit there that he let go. I know it's early and probably wanting to run his pitch count up, but he may not get another pitch like that to swing at the rest of the game. The one-two fouled off. The next one-two pitch. I like how he fouls everything else off, but the ones down the middle he had no problem missing because he just let him go. You gotta slow your swing down to hit the knuckler. Ow. Then you have to speed it up because now the ex but the recovery fucking clocked me. Good job that time of not God for my body. Into the box. So take that down. That was rocketed at me. In there at the knees as he offers a strike to the leadoff man, nothing in one. I thought my career is gonna fucking end in this. It's gonna get clocked, and it's gonna be an early end. Now the one and one pitch is in off the plate. Hey, I appreciate the fact that he's making him throw a few pitches. Most of his teammates have been hacking at everything that comes their way. Coming from the guy, he says, as the last guy was up in the last inning, made me throw a lot of pitches. And this one's tapped foul at home plate. Two, two, one more time. Not where I wanted that curve. Two and two. Yikes. Uh, two, two. Nice down hitting. I can respect the down the line hit. The also, this second. dude's really fast. And he's gonna get to Can't move. With nobody out. No doubt I like when I try to move my character just stares like, should I do something? That's exactly what he got. Got the barrel out front and just blasted it down the line for an extra base hit. Nobody out. Oh, couldn't get position. the inside. Great opportunity here. Sean Long is in for the second time now as he looks at a ball inside one and oh. Time that too early. <laughs> Left that one hanging. From the stretch. Right, I gotta get my timing back. The catcher's like, you got this. That was a great pitch. One, two. There we go. Leo Fisher. Leo Fisher. He got called out on strikes his last Oh my god. I'm up there batting apparently. Shit. He's obviously got a great feel for this in the early goings. I always said No, I don't. a good knuckleball was like trying to hit a paper airplane. Everyone always I let it fly. Oh, I missed. I, let it go. I never had any success with either of those approaches. Throw any hey, at least my guy actually attempted to reach for it. There are times where it just goes by him, and I'm like, should I, should I do something? To the plate, Joaquin Maldonado, runner in scoring position. Weak roller, right side. Garlobo, right there. Oh, I tagged him. <laughs> wow. One hit, one left. Get my 200-something fucking pound ass moving. My fucking big dude. I'm glad it went for the tag and not just trying to get, only go for the base. Close play, though. And then it goes right by me. This team fucked me up last time, so I'm not surprised that they're hitting against me here again. I'm not sure why I'm throwing on the inside. I don't want to throw there. Lustig gets his lead at first, nobody out. Swing. Oh, couldn't get the corner. Man. I think our man behind the plate thought twice about that one. About as close as it gets. Here's the one and two delivery. Oh, that's too low. And that one wasn't that low. Apparently. Hey, great job right there. Anytime you're two, 
I think it's a successful at bat if you can work it back to an even count. I'll just go with the sure out. Probably wouldn't have time to turn and throw second. Ball wasn't hit all that hard at me. Call it a swing and bunt. Oh, right at him. Look, you're redeeming yourself after your fuck up in that one game. <laughs> Riding in once again, Charlie Tilson. He's 0 for 1 thus far. Damn it. Lays off 1 and 0. Every time I go against this team, the umpires suck. They're not nice to pitchers. Zone strike 1. Now the 1 and 1 pitch. What's up? That's up. him up. Popped it up. Oh, and he got it. <laughs> A nice Nice dive. <laughs> the inning is over. Another look I'll take that. <laughs> Just barely got that. There's me out there. My triggers are by like R2, L2, and like my triggers are very sensitive on this thing, and I don't remember if that's the dive, and I was worried I might actually just dive like an idiot while I was running. Next thing I know, hurt my shoulder attempting a dive at nothing. Ooh. I'm glad he was taking a pitch. Grounder down the line at third. So that'll get foul. It's 0 and 2 now. Into the windup. Here comes the 0 2 pitch. Well, lost all. Uh, lost all control of that. Bases are empty. One man out. In out. In out. Rounded to the right. Oh, and he couldn't make it. Take some lessons from the third baseman. <laughs> Hey, just a nice piece of hitting right there. He's able to keep his hands inside that ball, stay square. Ah, my pitch count's gotten high from the early going, so and every time it's gone higher than a certain amount, definitely my stats have not been good. In now, Sean Long, as he'll take a look at a high strike that time. It's nothing in one. Clearly trying to control the running game with the slide step here. Yeah, that's a good way of trying to control the running game, Matt. The problem with it, though, it has a tendency to throw your command off because you're worrying about that runner on base. Hey, now the one and one pitch. Oy. Hit in the air to right field. Benitez. And it's down. Couldn't get it. You can't get there. All right. Oh, I thought he got him there. Son of a bitch. Well, not too upset if a run happens. You know, we got a lead. Stepping in now. But I'd like to limit the damage. With two strikes now and a runner at first, do you go for the strikeout or you're still looking for the double play ball? This is a great spot to be in as a pitcher. You have two strikes, you can bury one for a potential strikeout, and at worst, keep the ball down in the zone. You might be able to turn one pitch into an ending, ending double play. Down the first baseline. Uh, how fast is the guy on first? There is a chance for a double play. I'm not sure how fast this guy is. Round down the first baseline. Step on the back for one. That's an interesting way to get it, but you know what? We'll take it. You know, that works. He saved the run. Threw it to home. Got the guy. Thank God. What a throw, though. I couldn't see what even happened. It didn't let me, like, move the camera. I don't think I'm familiar with that unit of measurement of boatload. Down and in here, one ball, no strike. The 1 0 home. Runs oh. it inside for a ball. Yeah, real king eye. I had a boy. Shut now the, the fuck up over there. Three and oh now. He's been throwing strikes all day. So you're not up at the plate thinking he's going to walk you in this situation. You need to be aggressive. No, I'm walking you, apparently. And a fastball. I just have no control. They're just getting tired. What gave it away? Or maybe I was thinking about double play, but he flipped it so fucking poorly. Jesus. put this in his pocket and be content with just the one out. 
Like a fucking lob. And it's fouled away. Willie Bryant. On its way, the 0 1 pitch. Missed with a breaking ball. Gonzalez, the runner at first, with two gone. Jesus. Guys gotten all tired. Throwing 80 something pitches. Manager, some reason, well, I guess because we have a lead. I've been doing okay. So, if realistically, if we were looking at my stat line, anytime I've gotten over 70 pitches, I've gone to shit real fast. And then that happens. Damn it. Well, that's what you want from your curveball on one and two. You start it in the zone and let it break. I could jam them. Sometimes I go for that. Didn't get him to go after it. But the execution was nice. All on you. All right, manager, please get me the fuck out of here. Thank you. Let him play. I want to end on a quality start, damn it, or a win. Yeah, we won. Only three strikeouts, but you know what? I'm not planning to always strike him out. Hell of a lot better than the last game we went against, somewhere I lost. Last game, they whooped my ass. <clears throat> my knuckle break has regressed. So, yeah, that's it. After that. Like we won a few. Well, we definitely did not make it to the... Uh, yeah, we did not make it to the postseason in minor league. Fucking 60 and 80. Good job, team. Well, since we're here. Bullpen is these things. Velocity, grade 9. Control, my break. Oh, my stamina. All right. I feel like we could have fit more training in all this. Regular season's come to an end. Nope. The Giants, uh, or the Indians have defeated the Giants in the 2018 World Series. So the Indians have became the uh, champs. Would you look at that? Let's see who retired. If Batista... CC Sabathia. Alright, right. People just mainly abilities. No one no one retired due to an injury. And then just a shit ton of free agents. Yeah. I can't, weird that you can't constantly look back and see who retired if you were interested. It's like only this one time. No contract offers. Well, shit. Not like I'm going to get much. I'm going to get like one shitty ass contract because I can't go to free agency. No con Or I just won't get a contract. Oh. Oh, the Braves, since that's the only team I got. Um, I mean, there's not much else I could do with this. No, you know what? I want to be on the team for 15 years. That'd be fucking terrible. Um, I mean, they do kind of need the pitching staff. Their pitching isn't all that great, so I feel like I could make... Do it, but if we're thinking playoffs, we're, I don't think we're a playoff team. I don't really know much about the Braves. But you know what? I think I'm worth at least 75. They accepted it. I didn't think they would. All right, spring trading. All right, we're back to a 67 overall. We had the adjusted of 70s, but advance to regular season because I'm more than likely I'm not going to play in the fucking spring.